And what sort of foods do you think have strong links with the Northwest? Loads, I would imagine, yeah. loads. Apples, cakes. Yeah. Cheshire, Lancashire cheese, parched peas, black pudding almost certainly. But what about marmalade? Mm -hmm. Yep, you might have to start adding that to your list. Apparently, Dewars have been producing jams and marmalades in Manchester for over 128 years. Oh, you <laughs> Well done. Now they're stepping up to the breakfast plate in a bid to reclaim our regional identity with the launch of Manchester Marmalade. By the way, I loosened it. Mel Barham <laughs> went to find out more. <laughs> Flying along the conveyor belt, this is the first batch of the newly developed Manchester Marmalade. It's not been produced for more than 30 years. Now it's back in a bid to reclaim our regional identity. I think people are looking for products that are more locally made, that are made in the UK, and that are made in the area in which they live. So I think, yeah, it is important to, you know, to try and bring back that, that heritage. Dewars have been producing jams and marmalades since 1881. It was Mary Dewar and her husband Fred who founded the company. Five generations on, the family still runs the business from a factory in Withenshaw. So what makes this different from any other marmalade? It has a slightly higher fruit content. It's sugar, Seville oranges, a bit of lemon juice uh, and some tangerine oil just to give it a bit of a flavour boost. And this is it, Manchester marmalade. Surely the proof is in the tasting. So what do the people of Manchester think about their very own marmalade? It's got a nice sharp taste to it, which I like the marmalade. Very sweet as well. A little bit in here, there's a... Well, there's a few bits. bits. That's it, it's usually lots of bits, must be off marmalade. It just tastes very tangy. I don't really get how it rep represent Manchester, though. Let's try it. Yep. As marmalade goes, it's, it's, it's nice. It does remind me of Manchester because this is the only time I've tasted it in Manchester. <laughs> <laughs> so whenever I taste marmalade now, I'll think of Manchester. <laughs> so in Manchester. Um, yeah, definitely. Beautiful. Yeah, thank you. Mm. Well, that would be <laughs> The jars go on sale next week, but it'll be up to the public to decide if Manchester marmalade is a sweet success. Mel Barham, Granada Reports, Manchester. He did not lose... Actually, no, I didn't. I was just like, OK.